Yeah, right, I don't know what's going on at my house. I hear like people talking. <laughs> I mean, about relics and stuff. But uh, who, I don't got, know who these crazy people are. He's got better relics <laughs> laying around in his truck that's <laughs> junk than I've ever found. That's the first time I ever put my hands on a real Civil War bullet. Really? And he's got a bucket of them. I know. I'm going to have to film that bucket of them. Yeah, I just harvested We more got exploring his. Alabama and bird dog in my driveway. I don't know what's going on, guys, but I think we're going to try to go find some stuff. Let me see this bucket of bullets right quick. <laughs> it's ridiculous. <laughs> I said I've never even touched one. That's a couple days of hunting, actually. Yeah, bird dog's been trying to get me to come up, but oh, we're I told going. him it's so hard. <laughs> It's so that hard with tough. these kids, man. Tell me about it. Both of my kids have had the flu, and I've had allergies, and I'm just making a bunch of excuses, really, but, I mean. The yeah. bear's pears. The bear's pears, the bee's knees. Squirrel's pearls. The squirrel's pearls, yeah. <laughs> I need one for a possum. You saw possums the video. Possums blossoms. The possums blossoms, you're right. <laughs> Bird dog waxing poetic. But, yeah, I'd say we're ready to go, guys. There's, there's probably not going to be as many finds if we like if we would have went to bird dog spot we probably would find more but I mean, it just wasn't going to happen today my, my yeah, wife's doing a, a, a baby shower shoot and it just wasn't going to happen for me so i told him i was like we can do a video today but you're going to, have to come here and he was like yeah man I can, I can detect up here anytime so it's awesome always it's always awesome getting to meet up with these guys so maybe we'll go find something you got to stick around okay <laughs> was gonna be good luck so we got a new member of the baller club <laughs> right on we're in the right spot we should be able to find a mini ball here born alabama we're gonna try to put him on his first mini ball it's gotta happen today man it's gotta happen it's gonna happen i think it's gonna happen man i'm more familiar with these Alabama. <laughs> you're a trip dude i can find those <laughs> <laughs> well dude good luck to you man yeah, just man, cover as much ground as you can because I, I i know there's mini balls here first signal is like bouncy but everything's bouncy here for me so we'll see what it is together and stuff and that is a, that's what we call a nail a nail or a screw first target of the day has screwed me all right, I got a pretty good, like a high 50s, low 60s signal right here. Yeah, let's see what it is. I've dug a bunch of stuff since the last time I turned the camera on, but it's all been junk. And I'm pretty close to where I dug a bullet out here. Is or what you would call it. I dug several what you would call it today, but I dug that one live for y'all. Hope you enjoyed the live dig of the what you would call it. Yes, I'm laying on my back looking at the sky because I'm about dead. These allergies. I think it killed him. Man, my allergies. Somebody shoot that bullet at you or? 
Yeah, I'm having some allergic reactions for sure. Yeah, I think that was my spot. <laughs> Did you <Yeah>. scoot? <laughs> uh, where is it? It's in the hole. Oh. I dropped my pinpointer. I'm telling you, I feel like I've been run over by a tractor. Already. <sighs> I hope it wasn't my eyes deceiving me. No, nah, that's a bullet. Drop. Nice. That's Excellent. a pretty one too. That is. So what did it ring up on your at pro? Uh, this one was coming in like 75, 76. Yeah. I thought it was gonna be a piece of a can. And it, and it, nice, it had a, that uh, iron grunt in there like, like all of them do here, but for the most part, it was a pretty solid signal. Nice Excellent. job, yeah. That boosts morale. Maybe we'll give it 15 minutes from now. Yeah, Maybe you 15 can get them. minutes from now. And <laughs> punch then, uh, you a circle. Right here, dude. Right here, here dude. <laughs> punch you a circle around here now. Yeah, I'm going to go on. You, because, nice, guys. Hey, you need to come right here and spiral outward. We won't put you on your first. Slowly backing away. <laughs> awesome, man. That just goes to show you, though, how easy it is to just... You're for your coal to miss a target because oh, yeah. any one of us out here would have dug that. I mean, it was just, it's one of the best signals I've had today. Now here, see if you can see that or hear that. See if you can hear that. <laughs> I doubt it. Iron. Mine's not picking anything up, man. Nothing. Nothing. Huh. What's your discrimination set at? Nothing. There's definitely something there. <laughs> Oh, here, I'm just going to film it, so. Well, it's trash. Yeah, but you never know what it, I mean. Oh, I know it's trash. I just want to see what it is. I can almost guarantee it. There it is right there. Let me see if mine will pick it up now. Yes, yeah, iron. Yep. I figured it was. There's a little chirp every now and then, but it's probably a nail. That one's coming in a lot chirpier than it was not nothing. It's iron. Hit it from this angle and see what it does. Any difference? I think it's iron, but I dig it. Dig it because it's not grunting. It's not grunting like it's iron, but it's a reverse signal. So it could be a piece of brass. Walking I'll see what it is, and I, and I have noted I, I, the uh, like melted campfire lead here. Man, it comes in so horrible. About the worst. Huh? This thing will throw any machine off nearly. Maybe not that machine, because a bent square now. Oh, yeah. This is like a 75, 76 signal, pinpointing kind of small. Might be a shotgun shell, but we'll see. It's amazing how one bullet can boost the morale. This might be a dang bullet the way it's the way it's acting. Piece of campfire lead. That's what that is for sure. Melted lead from the Civil War. I'll take it. Well, it's been some rough digging out here, y'all. Get that right. I've dug probably 20, 15, 20 shotgun shells, a bunch of iron. And we're going to try to go to a, a property where I dug that block eye button. So stick around. Maybe we'll find, maybe we'll be able to get onto something over here. This, this other property, if we're able to get on it, it had not been hit as hard as, uh, as this one. Especially not by me. I think I've only been there twice, so. Yeah, it's hot. It's hot today. We got we we gotta get exploring Alabama on his first bullet. That is the goal today, to get him on a bullet. So stick around, maybe we'll do that. <laughs> Woke me up. Property number two, mission 
put Exploring Alabama on his first bullet. <laughs> yes. Well, that's always a good sign. Broken horseshoe. Old one too. Put it in the pouch. Hey guys, I'm gonna show you these trenches. Some earthworks. Cut through here. At least that's what I've been told, and it lines up with the map, so who knows. Pretty, pretty interesting though. I've never found anything in trenches, or what I've been told about trenches, except junk. Probably because 80% of what I've been told are trenches usually aren't trenches but <coughs> these are probably trenches on this property but I'm gonna shut up and try to get on a target well guys I just dug a Civil War relic check it out some musket ball round ball that is awesome I'll take it. All right, come on, let's get serious. Let's find some, let's find some brass. Let's find some brass, okay? All right, guys, I want to show you this signal. It's probably trash. It's probably a can in this hole right here, but 82. We gotta dig that. It's coming in small too. Let me make sure it's not right on top of the ground. It could be a 22 casing. Always a good sign. This thing right here kind of got my heart going a little bit. Right under a big root. It's always a good sign. small still reading like 82 to 85 maybe it, it might be a piece of silver i don't know but it's right under this root <clears throat> is a coin i'm afraid to clean that thing up i don't know what that is it's got a rim like a copper on the side hmm I don't know, y'all. I don't know what that is. Let me see if I can get something off of it. Sorry, Kurt. My foo foo bottle's at home, buddy. not knowing what, what this is I think it's a weedy I see the ones the one now good god almighty that shows you I don't know much about coins I should have known that it couldn't have been nothing too good oh man all right stick around well I'm out here in this little by this little spring and I just uh, I just saw I bought this little bottle it says 20 two and a half ounces that's a pretty cool one I'm gonna keep that pretty cool bottle I don't find many bottles I like finding bottles maybe we'll find some more bottles maybe we'll find some more stuff maybe you guys should stick around all right here's the wrap up we have a little pistol ball <laughs> nice this is the three wave video wrap up <laughs> Man, that, that is that, a cool. That would have made my day right there. Man, that is a cool Stick knife. It in your bag, it's no, all you. <laughs> it ain't as good. Dang, it's going in. But what you didn't find, 
<laughs> was this oh, ice snap. maker thing. Oh, oh yeah. What are you talking I see. About? I want to know what that was. <laughs> Get on. That's going on the wall. That's some ice cold ice. <laughs> That's it. Mm. I, I've enjoyed it, guys. Man, I really I'm, appreciate I'm, it. We're going to do it again. Well, yeah. We're well, going to find something. I'm, I'm, I'm going to get us some permissions around here. Try to find some ground that hadn't been dug to death. Sounds good. I've enjoyed it. I told these boys next time we get together, we'll try <laughs> something I saw on YouTube. It's called Relic Hunting. <laughs> yeah, we're going we'll we're gonna to need a, a, we're gonna need a new guide. I about, I about stomp these, these haulers around here to death. <laughs> so good. true. All right. Thanks for watching, everybody. I finally found a bottle that'll hold all my bullets that I've found. <laughs> Before I end this video though, I just, I do want to um, suggest that, uh, that you all go and check out Bird Dog's channel and Exploring Alabama. Hopefully this summer we're going to be doing a lot of videos together in the, uh, in the waterways around here. And uh, Exploring Alabama, they both have good channels, Exploring Alabama, that dude is a trip. Bird Dogs make some great videos too. If y'all like my videos, you'll like their videos. So, uh, might not have a lot of really exceptional finds in this video, but I mean, that's just part of it. Um, the, both the kids have been sick. Uh, Amanda and I have had allergies, so I know that we didn't get a video out this past week, but uh, so, as soon as I get this one edited, I'll have a video out. So, you guys have a good night.